When we start designing a new product, I think our primary concern is to make it as invisible as possible. The whole philosophy behind DCS is to present the music without interfering with it, without getting in the way, without changing it or adding our own personality. It really comes back to the, the origins of the company and it's about being in service of the music, being a, a mirror into the recording. The most uh, important uh, aspect of our design is the ring deck. This is a, a, a D2A conversion technology which provides, amongst other things, extremely good linearity. And what that means really is, is, is not adding extra stuff, not affecting the sound in any way. Lino was really an outgrowth of the Bartok headphone DAC. We were aware that we had a DAC which, in terms of sound quality, was very appealing to the HeadFi market, but also its footprint, its physical attributes, uh, the convenience factor, weren't really what that market needed. The Lena Network DAC was completely focused on delivering a full DCS performance experience in a new form factor. There was an acknowledgement that the, the headphone community had unique needs. It was a unique listening experience. It was different than what we've been doing for the prior 30 plus years of speaker-based systems. The main objective was to take a really good DAC like the Bartok and make it smaller. There was also a wish with Lena Network DAC to create a more approachable user interface. So time was taken to redevelop the UI, the buttons, both for function and on-off, and the menu structures throughout. We uh, endeavoured to capture all of the sonic uh, attributes of our current product range, uh, but in a much more convenient, user-friendly format. That sounds like a fairly easy job. Um, but the, the ring architecture is such that it's physically big. And so we've, we've had to make really quite radical steps in terms of how do you actually get a Bartok in something half the width. In the Lena DAC, um, we've used a, what's called a flex rigid PCB. Oh, the, the, the PCBs that we design um, are, are kind of laid out here and, and designed with performance as the number one requirement. So the, the flex, flex rigid circuit boards gives us the advantage that we can fold the board into to fit the available space and minimises the connections between different parts of the circuit. We actually have some different filters in there that are specifically designed for headphone listening. Andy McCarg spent a lot of time readdressing the whole needs of Crossfeed. You know, we spent probably three or four years working on what has become Expanse. That's patented at this moment. That was something that was really trying to take into mind, you know, can we improve the overall headphone listening experience, recognizing that Expanse CrossFeed in general is basically picking up the limitations and the inadequacies in certain recordings and certain tracks. These are all um, really an evolution of, of, of kind of the DCS DNA is, is in all the, all the Lena products. We haven't cut any corners. This is about how can we design a DAC that um, has this feature set in this footprint. It was really ambitious. You know, it's, it's been a real challenge to, to get all of those electronics and all of that software and hardware into those boxes. But at its core, it still uses the same filtering, upsampling, streaming and, and DAC technology. Um, you know, and it's still the same expertise that's been applied to it. It takes, you know, time and effort to get it right because at the end of the day, it's a DCS product. It's got to be really good. It's got to be the best in the market. We wanted that oh wow experience. So that's that's the you know sort of qualitative assessment. The DCS house sound has not been altered at all. You have that infinite high end that no one else has ever been able to get to. There's no roll off. It just keeps going and going and going. We paid quite a lot of attention to realism in in image size, in realistic sound stage. You know, the tonal balance is perfection, in my opinion. Throughout the frequency range, the entirety of how coherent it is, I call it the hooky system, because all you want to do when you turn on Lena is play hooky from life. You want to ignore your job. 
your personal life. You want to ignore everything and just listen. 